Hey there. Um, forgive me, and I'm eating chocolate as I do this today. Um, <clears throat> I need it because I'm a little shaky at the moment because I'm back on the um, the puffers. Um, I was gonna try and hold out, and uh, I was gonna try and force my allergies to hold out until we actually went to Alberta in a couple of weeks, um, where the pollen counts are actually higher. But um, whatever I'm allergic to seems to have come back with force and uh, this past three or four days I've been like hacking and completely blocked up and I'm like okay fine I'll take the drugs. Um, so while I'm introducing the flow vent I still have to take the Ventolin uh, because to open up the airway so the flow vent can get in and the Ventolin still makes me kind of shaky. Um, and in the end I'm sure chocolate is messing with my blood sugar levels but it does make me feel better. And probably just, you know, by the time I finish the chocolate, my shaking is gone anyway, but it's a good excuse. It's good chocolate. It's dark chocolate. Not cheap chocolate, but very good. Um, so there you go. And uh, so even though I know that the last couple of days my pollen counts have been bugging me, what do we do today? We go to the plant store. So <laughs> I don't have a green thumb. I have a history of killing pretty much anything and everything that I get near in terms of plants. But um, every now and then I just feel the need to try. Uh, my husband is the one that actually takes care of all the indoor plants because if um, I try to take care of the indoor plants, he doesn't believe that I'm actually taking care of the indoor plants, so we end up killing them with too much love, overwatering them, and um, or I start doing it and then I forget to do it and then so he starts to take care of them but then it's too late or we're both taking care of them or I'm taking care of them inappropriately or it's a mess so I'm I think my husband is looking at the stuff we bought today and resigning himself to the fact that they will end up being his plants but um, in the meantime <laughs> we bought some plants and we're calling that my Mother's Day present because next Sunday um, we're actually going to be on the road on the way to see my sister and uh, I'll have to leave instructions for my house sitter to look after our plants. Uh, that's the one thing we don't put our... the dog and the cat are getting too old and stuck in their ways to put them in the kennels and by the time we would put um, both of them in kennels it's actually cheaper to have somebody come stay at our house and then you have the bonus of actually having somebody staying at our house uh, with a lot more regularity than we usually are here so it's kind of nice. So she'll get to look after my plants on Mother's Day. But, um, yes, they're gorgeous. I'll actually post a picture of, of the one um, on Wednesday for the midweek photo op. And uh, you can see what I got my hands on, and uh, hopefully it's still alive by Wednesday. That would be interesting. Um, and hopefully my flow vent is kicked in by Wednesday, too, and I don't have to... Um, don't have to deal with everybody asking me every single time I turn around, oh, are you, are you stuffed up? Have you got a cold? You sound a little bit, you know, throaty in a... Yeah, okay. Yes, we know. Um, but even if I'm feeling better, don't worry, I'll still be eating the chocolate. Um, that's it. I'm gonna go finish my chocolate. Very quick one today. Gotta get going and start supper. You know, to go with the chocolate. Bye.